Today we have 2154D John Deere processor with your favorite 68 diesel and fan belt failed. We have to replace that. As you can see, it started splitting, it's uh, separated a bit. And yeah, 50 mil socket. We need to remove the fan guard. Guys, if you first time to the channel, please subscribe. Very appreciated that. Click that notification bell as well. Okay, pull that guard out and release the tension on the belt. Pull the tensioner up and same 15 mil socket and your ratchet. And now we have to go behind the radiator fan. Just pull that belt behind each blade and it will come out. Here we go. As you can see, rubber is still good. There's no even cracks along or across and it just split. Well one year old uh, this belt has been probably for over a year this is napa v belt it's not oem john deere one which is best i would say but it worked well okay good time to check the hub make sure there's no play on the bearing and make sure nothing's loose and, and just check all pulleys we need to clean that guy and um, yeah inspect checked everything because we don't have a belt there and it's good time to do that and uh, yeah that Napa belt uh, uh, worked well and it was uh, probably three times four times less than OEM one but that someone replaced it put that belt and whatever okay and let's do the cleanup make sure there's no gunk no any debris on the rollers on the pulleys and ready for the new belt wipe them out i am using the brake clean and blow everything what's on the pulleys or and do the cleanup it's a good idea to assemble the clean parts and make sure it will last okay this is ic delco this is not oem dear one and we didn't have one in place in the shop and it so was three days away we decided yeah let's pick it up a local automotive part one and yeah well 40 bucks anyway it's the same belt same length and if it will go for another year or less who cares and uh, yeah the same way as we removed old one place it new one and as you can see, everything's pretty much straightforward. Tons of room. It's not like you work on a front-wheel drive modern car. Yeah. Okay, make sure your belt is properly engaged. It's all in, on the pulleys, on the rollers, and all in grooves. And nothing's uh, sideways. No. Okay. And then check to make sure it's all aligned properly. And now we're ready to set our tension as you can see the tensioner is right there so easy to set a tension it's all automatic tensioner with a spring pull the tensioner and slide the belt over the alternator pulley yeah sometimes it's easy to go over the smooth roller but we have some slack it's not a big of a deal okay and i'm going to i'm checking to make sure belt is properly installed and Voila! Well, always good to go and check and make sure everything's done right. And yeah, even if this is a not OEM belt, it will work. And uh, yeah, <laughs> okay, let's go and uh, start the machine and check it out, guys. If it's helpful, yeah, thumbs up, comments, critics, suggestions, all put down in the comment section below. Very appreciated that. <laughs> Don't forget to put a fan guard back. Thank you so much, guys. See you soon and bye-bye now.